Hey friends, how are you? I hope you're having a great day today. Today we will be making a beaver, so let's get started. The first thing that we're going to do is make his head. And I like to make my beaver's heads, they're kind of like a diamond shape, but they have really soft corners. The next thing that we're going to do is make his eyes, and they're going to be wide set, meaning they're going to be far apart on the face. So I'm going to make some ovals. Inside those ovals, I'm going to make some small circles, and then I'm going to fill in the bottom part of my oval with my marker. That way we've created a little shine mark, a little reflection mark in the eye. Now we're going to make a, a couple little eyebrows, and then we're going to go down here to his nose and to his mouth. So for his nose, we're just going to make a line and then a U and then color that in. And then for his mouth down here, beavers have those really cool and big teeth. So we go like this. Now let's go back up here to the top of his head and we're going to make some small ears. Your ears aren't that large. Now we're going to come down here to his body. And to make a cartoon be beaver's body, basically you make a curve line and a curve line and then come up here for his arms. I like to just make arms that look like this. They're very, very simple and little hands at the end with some fingers, like little spikies. Let's create a little detail in his tummy. And then for his feet, we're just going to have them come out the side. And basically I'm going to go like this and like this. And then I'm going to close up at the bottom. I might even put a toe in there. For his tail, we're going to make it nice and large and coming out the side. And then inside his tail, I like to make a pattern. And to make a pattern, basically I just make straight lines like this, and then I make straight lines going the other way, perpendicular to the first lines. Now for the background scene for our beaver, I think I'm going to make him near a pond. So I'll put some ground so that he can stand on. Did you see what I did? I drew a line here. I jumped over his body so it looks like he's, so the line's not going through his body. And then I ended up coming out this way. Now I'll put a little bit of greenery down here. And maybe I'll even put this type of plant as well. So we have curve line, oval with a little line at the top, curve line, oval with a little line at the top, and then same here. Might put a couple of clouds in the sky or a sun. It's completely up to you. After you make the clouds, if there's anything else that you'd like to put onto your beaver picture, you can go ahead and do that now. And there is one thing that I forgot to put on my beaver. I'd like to put a couple of little whiskers. That just adds a little bit more detail to his face. So I hope you enjoyed this lesson. I'll see you next time.